Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be telling you some ball bucket list ideas for this year. And I pretty much got a lot. So I'm not going to give it like a demonstration for each. Anyway, I am so pumped that fall season is coming up because it's that cool weather. Um, Halloween is coming up, which is my favorite holiday, and <sighs> hmm. there's also Thanksgiving break, winter break, you know what happens during those, there's no school, yeah, alright, I have 25 ideas for a fall bucket list, or you can include them into yours. Feel free to take it away from me. The first one is that you can go apple picking at your local orchard. And apple season is pretty much around the corner. And wait, is it already apple season? Hmm. Number two is that you cook with squash, which is a fall vegetable, or you can cook with fall vegetables. They'll make it seem out of festive. Go on a spooky graveyard tour. I haven't done that since five years ago. I went to Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, which is like pretty much ghost town. I did a ghost tour. That was pretty fun. It was so cool. We were trying to hunt ghosts, and my sister pretty much cried the whole time, and that was a big embarrassment. <sighs> Getting lost in a corn maze. I do that every year, and pretty much every year I get lost. We usually go at night with flashlights, and that is a little bit more tougher than doing it in the daylight. Go on a hay ride. You can watch a scary movie under a pile of cozy blankets with a cup of coffee or clean tea that you can't like, be any happier than that. Seven is go to a haunted house, which I've never done before, but I would love to. I'm a big fan of scary movies and horror stuff, like the paranormal. That's my thing. Toast pumpkin seeds. Go for a walk on a foggy morning. It doesn't have to be too early in the morning. It could be at like, I don't know. 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, or, wait, when does Fox start coming up? Pretty much any time of the day, I think. I would like to do that because I like some exercise. Number 10, drink apple cider. I haven't had apple cider since my childhood, so... Pretty much more than five years ago. I don't know why I didn't drink apple cider. But this year, I'm definitely gonna have apple cider. Visit a pumpkin patch and pumpkin of your choice. Once you got a pumpkin, cut the pumpkin. Get rid of the ooey gooey, orange gooey gooey. But save the pumpkin seeds. Make pumpkin pie play-doh. I never heard of that one before. Go check out trading. Get some free candy. Me, I'll eat candy because not a lot of them are vegan. So, yeah, I'm pretty much staying home that night. How fun. You can break leaves and then jump into the leaves. No matter if the leaves just disperse all over the backyard or front yard or anywhere you're trying to break up leaves, don't worry about it. 
Yet the wind handled it. I don't think I've ever jumped in a pile of leaves because I'm afraid that there's bugs in it. And I don't want bugs anywhere near me. Have a bonfire. Sometimes if it's chilly, you can always have like a bonfire. Have some s'mores maybe. And just, I don't know, be warm near the fire. Number 17, drink pumpkin pie coffee. There's nothing better than that. I've been to the grocery store. I've noticed that the plant silk, they have an almond creamer that's pumpkin spice flavored. I tried it and it's so good. It tastes like pumpkin pie. And I'm like, thank you. Go hiking. Get cozy. Number 20 is you can listen to autumn related songs, which I have created an autumn playlist in my description. You can check that out if you want. Make chili with cornbread. You know what's even better? Pumpkin cornbread. Yeah, that sounds genius. Attend a fall festival if you live near one. I don't think I have one near me. Hmm. I don't even know what happens on a fall festival. <sighs> For Starbucks lovers out there, fall tanks are back. Last one is read spooky stories if you like reading spooky stories. And... If you don't like spooky stories, you can read like, I don't know, a funny horror story, if that helps. I hope you liked this video, and I hope that this video helped you, like, get some ideas for your own bucket list, and I'm here to help. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. Bye.